sección 1 y sección 2. Ah, ok. Gracias. Hello, good evening. Good evening. That's all, bro. Hello, William. Hello, guys. Hello, teacher. How are you? Hi, five. Perfect. Okay. So just give me one second, please. Mm -mm 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 -mm. There we go. Creo que tiene bastante interferencia, Miguel, ahí en el, en el audio. Vamos a ponerle el mute. Thank you. Julio, this is your first time in the class? Yes. Ajá. I was thinking, Julio, I have not seen Julio. So this is your first time, okay? So, but have you been working on the platform, Julio? Yeah, I just finished. The presentation one point four. I I think think this is the part to I have to have been finished the the last week. Yes, this week we are going to finish section three. So we're working on section three already. So if you can start trying to complete that, because uh, by Thursday, we need to complete section three and we need to complete the meter that is at the end of section three. Okay. okay. I'm going to work in this. Okay, perfect. Thank you, Julio, and welcome to the class. Thank you. Mm -hmm. And also I see Marcela Aviles. Is this your first time in the class, Marcela? Hello, good evening. Yes, it's my first time. Ah, uh, okay. And have you been working on the platform? Uh, no, no. Uh, because today uh, I full, uh, fulfill the description. Okay, ah, so today you fulfilled the inscription. Oh, okay, 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 I understand. Yes, yes. Okay, so, um, but they give you, did they give you a password and like a link to get in the platform? Yes, yes. yes. Oh, okay, so try to work yes, on, have. try to work on that because we are going to be finishing section three and the midterm this week, okay? Okay. okay thank you very much okay thank you for being in the class as well okay um we're gonna start because i need to go with the topic we have for today as you know this week we're gonna be studying section three and the midterm okay so i'm gonna share my screen with you and also remember okay for the ones that are new uh, last week and this week, we have been studying tongue twisters. The tongue twisters are like tres tristes tigres, but in English, right? So we're gonna do that to improve pronunciation. Uh, this week, we're studying how much wood would a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood. That's the tongue twister we have for this week. Let me just go ahead with this. But before we start the class, 
do you have any questions about the platform? Problems? Or is everything okay? I mean, I understand. Uh, I can understand uh, the exercise in the section three. You can understand? Yes, I can understand. Can't understand. Can't. I can't understand. Which exercise? Uh, the first. The first uh, exercise. I, I need I need uh, one example for the exercise. Okay, let me see. Oh, it's because it's the classes and the gerunds. Yeah, 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 I understand. <sighs> Could not write the whole request, only the, the completion of it. Make sure you use the correct spelling and punctuation. You have to use your roommate's computer. Is it okay? Okay, okay, okay. Actually, we're gonna be studying this topic today. Um, and I'm gonna be explaining that to you, Marcos, today. But let me see if I can help you with that. If I, is it okay if I use your computer? Is it okay if I use your computer? Yeah, 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 I'm gonna be explaining that, don't worry. This is the topic that I have for today, okay? Well, two topics okay, I have for today, two, two topics, thanks, okay. Man. Perfect, Do, did you practice the tongue twister, guys? Yes. Okay, so who wants to try? Who wants to try? Voluntary. You want to say it, Marcos? Uh, yes. Okay, okay, go ahead. How much would a, would a woodchuck chuck is a woodchuck called chuck wood? Repeat the first part. How much would, would a woodchuck chuck is a woodchuck? Uh, <laughs> I, <laughs> if a woodchuck could is a woodchuck, chuck, could chuck wood. Okay, when you say it slower, it's better because I can hear your pronunciation of how much wood would a woodchuck. Okay, that's better. Thank you very much, Marcos, thank you. So who else besides Marcos wants to try today in this moment? Um, the next try Oh, you're gonna is... choose a person, okay. Yes. Um... Miguel Angel Ramirez. Okay, Miguel, you have been chosen. He's frozen. San Juan, hello, he's frozen. Hello. Miguel. Okay, Adriana. <laughs> Adriana, Adriana, please. Hello, good evening, everyone. Good evening. Okay, I, I will try it. Okay. Okay. How much would a wood wood shook shook if a wood shook wood shook wood? Very good, very good, <laughs> very good, you. Adriana. But just I remember was the... a little bit nervous. No, <laughs> it's okay, it's okay, don't worry. You, you did good. But remember, it's not chook, it's chuck. Okay, okay. it's chuck. It. Okay, you. very good. So I'm gonna share the screen so everybody can see what we're saying. So this is the zone picture we're practicing. Remember how much. Would, woulda, would chuck, chuck, if a would chuck, could chuck, would. Remember, guys, this is very important for your pronunciation. It's going to help you improve your pronunciation. Pronunciation. Your pronunciation is going to get better with the tongue twisters. But if, don't go fast. Uh, that's important, but it's not the most important thing. What is really important is you have to say word by word. So you have to do the pronunciation of every word. How much would, would a, uh, would chuck, chuck, if a, uh, would chuck, could chuck, would. Okay, how much, how much would, would a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? Okay, like that. 
Now, I'm gonna send you to breakout rooms to practice a little bit, and then we're gonna come back. But remember guys, it is important, very important to say word by word, because if you don't say word by word, it's, no importa si lo dice rápido, it's about the pronunciation, okay? Just something really quick. Let me see, we have some new people today. Yeah. Guys, remember that it's important, uh, por auditoría es importante eh, la cámara. Solo si usted tiene un problema como bien grave de que no le funcionó algo, de que la cámara se arruinó, pero lo va a arreglar mañana, está bien. De lo contrario, las cámaras son bien importantes. Uno, porque me ayudan a reconocerle. Yo me recuerdo quiénes son los que han estado en clase. Y dos, porque por auditoría este video queda en YouTube y si usted me dicen y tal persona estaba conectada yo pues sí ahí estaba el nombre me dicen pero no sale nunca en la sección entonces ahí sí va a ser complicated ok recuerden que esto es una beca yes you're not paying this is a scholarship it's important todas las becas tienen sus requisitos ok let's go we're gonna go like five minutes no more than five minutes to practice and then we're gonna come back Qué bonito se ven mis students. Very good. Excellent.
I would have worked chuck chuck if I would to, to, to work. Okay, okay, me. How much good would I got chuck chuck if I got chuck? Good chuck good. How much good would I got chuck chuck if I got chuck good chuck good? Sandra. Liliana. Liliana. Oh. I don't listen. You can. I will try it. Okay. How much wood would I would chuck chuck if I would chuck good chuck good? Wow. Okay. How much would would a wood chop chop if I would chop could chop wood? That's right. It's excellent, bro. Great. Yeah. So I think food is the next. Okay. How much wood would a uh, wood chuck chuckify wood chuck cool chuck wood? Yeah, Repeat. wood chuck, but it was good. Thank you. That the name is a good word. For example, how? Okay, okay. What is good? How? Yes. Much. How? Okay. Repeat. How? How, how much? Much. That's much. It. How much? How much? How much? Okay. Now, how much good? How much good? How much good? Okay. Now, how much good? Uh? No, no, no. Um, it will be no. how, how much good? Good. <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. That the 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 the, the, the four the four word. How much good Buddha? Uh -huh. How much okay. wood? How much wood Buddha? Sela, what happened? Hello, I'm sorry, I have issues with my internet connection. Okay, and you were in the breakout room number three? Uh, yes. Okay, I'm gonna send you there. There you go. Marcos, what happened? Sorry. But what happened? You are off the, the, the breakout room, what happened? Sorry, I pressed the bottom of uh, escape. Mm. I use uh, I use the my by accident. Yes. <laughs> okay, lo voy a enviar, pero no ahí no le toca, ahí no le toca. Pero me lo voy a enviar a la suya. That's number two. Yeah. Glenda, what happened? Oh, you you were in here. Well, what group were you in? Don't remember? I'm gonna send you here. Uh, two. Marcos, no se una a la que le voy a mandar invitación. Ahí no se una, no se una. Le voy a mandar de nuevo a la dos. Ahí sí únase.
I'm sorry, Miss. I'm pretty old. A for please L L Q. <laughs> Don't worry. It's okay because I called everyone. It's okay. So everybody is coming to the to the main session. So don't worry. Okay. So when I went there, I realized a problem. Remember what I told you. It's not about doing it fast. The first thing is about pronunciation. So it doesn't matter if I go like and I'm like Eminem. No, I'm not Eminem. I'm learning English and I need to say every word there. So the first thing that I need to do is start saying, how much, much. And if you see, I say much. I don't say much, mm -mm. much, much. I don't say much, you see? <sighs> Okay, I'm going to say this in Spanish. En inglés tenemos 15, si no me equivoco, 15 sonidos de vocales. No es I, yo. For example, when I say book, se fijan que hay dos O juntas y yo digo book. Pero porque cuando digo door, digo door y no dur. No han pensado eso. Ajá. Pasa que las vocales suenan diferentes según las letras consonantes que estén a su lado. Por lo que, cuando yo tengo, por ejemplo, la palabra much, mis alumnos me dicen, teacher, pero es much o es much. Y yo ni much ni much. Es much. Much. ¿Se fijan? Ahí pongamos atención. Much much, how, much, and this one, many people saying this incorrect, would, would, the, 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 would, how much, would, would, it's not good, no es gura gura, <laughs> because many of you are saying gura gura, and it's not gura gura, it's would, would, a, uh, would, chuck, chuck. And it's chuck, chuck. It's not chuck, it's chuck, chuck. Okay? So how much would, would, a, uh, would, would. And another thing, the pronunciation. Let me finish this quick because we have the other things to do. The pronunciation of this word and this word, it's the same pronunciation. Would, 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 would. Don't say gura gura, no. Would, woulda. How much would, would a. Uh, would chuck, chuck. If I would chuck, could chuck, would. Okay, I heard some people that were doing a great job. So that's very good. I like that you were practicing. I heard that some people were helping their classmates, which is good. So thank you very much for that. And try to practice more. For example, in your free time. But don't be like, yo, pira, teacher, paso practicando todo el día aquí en la mente, lo ando. Es como que yo diga, mire, yo hago sentadillas en mi mente y viera que las piernas igual, siempre. Toda la vida, right? So, yo voy al gym mentalmente. Todos los días salgo a correr de cinco y media a seis, pero aquí, mire, sueño yo eso, pero nada. So, si me anda repasando el tongue twister aquí, ¿qué va a pasar? Nothing. It's, nothing is going to happen. You need to practice. No es mentira que las cuerdas bucales y los músculos en la boca están acostumbrados a hablar español. ¿Ok? 
Entonces, cuando yo quiero hablar un segundo idioma, la gente dice, no, pero es que, mire, yo lo entiendo, pero ya hablarlo es el problema. Ya les dije, si me, dijeran, me dieran dinero por eso, yo sería millonaria cada vez que me han dicho eso. Pero, ¿qué pasa? Que usted solo quiere oírlo, pero no quiere hablarlo. ¿Right? Entonces, usted tiene que entrenar sus cuerdas bucales y los músculos de su boca para hablar, ¿qué? English. ¿Cómo vamos a hacer eso? Ya les dije, apréndanse canciones por su cuenta. En grupo no es una buena idea. And please practice the tongue twisters. But do it like this. How much would, would I place yourself in front of a mirror and say, how much would, would I, and look at your mouth. Don't be like, how much would, 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 No, that's not going to be anything good for you. Remember, we need to do it to improve our pronunciation. It's not thinking, it's doing it, okay? ¿Todos aquí tienen un smartphone o no? Ustedes andan un, un, un antirrobo, andan ustedes, ¿no? Graben un audio y escúchense. Siempre nosotros hablamos inglés Creemos que hablamos inglés mejor de lo que en realidad lo hablamos. Se lo digo por experiencia. When I'm speaking, I'm like, yo, hablo inglés así, like what, like this, like this, and like this. Pero cuando escucho mi grabación, híjole, así hablo yo. Ok. So what you need to do is record yourself and do it like, ¡Eh! ahí dije gura, gura, y es good, ah, good, gura. Right. So you're going to see. Please do it because you're going to improve your pronunciation. Okay, I'm going to send you a video that we're going to practice in this moment. It's going to be really fast. Again, who are the people in computers right now? So Marcos is in a computer. Julio is in a computer. Um, who else is on a computer right now? Jose, Jose Manuel, and Jessica. Okay, so perfect, perfect. We're going to do those four groups. And I'm gonna, so, so I sent you a video there. We're gonna play that video and we're gonna answer some questions. So I'm um, here, look at these questions. It says, watch the video below and take note of all the favors. Maybe you, some of you did this already, but of all the favors, favors that are asked. So make a list of the favors that are asked. Which are the favors that would, would, look, would, that would bother, what is bother guys? Not brother, is bother, what is bother? Yeah. Molestar. Exactly, that will Don't bother you up. the most. So what is something that will bother you the most from the video? Which would you, which will bother you the least. So it's okay that you do it. Okay, so the first thing we're, need to, we're gonna need to do is to share the screen and share and make a list. And then we're gonna discuss with our classmates what favors will bother me the most and what favors will bother me the least. Do you understand the activity? Yeah? Yes. Perfect. Yes. Um, so I see that Jose Manuel has a computer, okay? So Jose Manuel, bien. Then Marcos is in another one. Then Jessica, where is, oh, Jessica is here. I'm gonna move it here. And then, It was, it was, it was, it was, it was Julio, right? Julio. So estas personas son las que van a compartir su pantalla. You're going to share your screen and answer the questions. Just wait a second. There we go.
Thank you again, Miss. Thank you. Oh, okay, okay, don't worry. I'm gonna send you pop pop on here. Don't worry. Yeah. Mm -hmm. There you go, Marcel, as well. I send you the invite. I still invite Marcela, no se preocupe. Se lo mandé, le llegó. You get it? No, si no le llegó, lo muevo a otra. Don't worry. That. There, excellent.
alto, volumen alto. Oh, ok. Ok. Mira, no, watch. Hello. So we only have two people in this breakout room. What happened with the other person? I can say. Hmm? No sé qué le habrá pasado, pero estábamos tres. Ah, ok, ok, ok. But did you watch the video already? Yeah. Ok, ok, perfect. So you're now, now, now you're talking about the video? Yeah. Ok, perfect. Uh, and the, 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 the little sister is a uh, most, uh, most nervous. nervous. Yeah. She has to do the she has to do the homework and then uh, she she wants to see uh, watch a movie but no finish the homework and then and the she is the invite to the eat pizza and then watch a movie and and the last uh, she and uh Read a book. <laughs> I, okay, that's I understand about the video, and I don't know. I don't know you. Uh, what understand? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I can see at the last, at the last, at the last. Uh -huh. I can see. So there, there is one one person that need to take care of her son. Y no quieren venir, mire, solo ustedes vienen. The other ones están en el gossip. They are gossiping.
si miren, no quieren venir, solo ustedes. <ríe> Dirty Com, ya los obligué a venir. Hello. Hi. Why didn't you want to come here? You were gossiping. You were talking about stuff. Or you were talking about the homework. Yeah? Yes? About the activity? Yes. Okay. Thank you, Marcela. Thank you very much. Your classmates are shy today. They are really shy. I don't know what happens. They are like, no, I'm not going to speak. Okay. Perfect. Thank you. Okay. Uh, now I'm going to explain a topic really quick for you because we need to go with the topic. And I heard you practicing about the, the video that we saw. Um, the topic is about the, uh, the question that Marcos did at the beginning of the class with the classes. Okay, so I'm going to share my screen so I can help you with this. If you see, there's a video explaining this topic in very detail in the 3.3 request with models if classes and gerunds. Okay, so here we have requests with models or if classes and gerunds. For example, you can see this picture right here. It says, let me, wait a second. Okay, there. Okay, there. Here, we have ways to ask for something. This can be really informal ways or really formal ways. So for example, you see this arrow in here, it's showing you that this way of asking for something is very informal. It's a request that is not so formal. Then in this part, we have the most formal requests that we can make. For example, if you wanna ask for something, or if you wanna request something to your friend, or to someone you know, you say, hey, can I borrow your pencil? And that's going to be okay because you are friends. Okay. Can I borrow your pencil? Like that. Then something a little bit more formal, instead of saying can, you can say could. Could. The pronunciation of this word, guys, is almost like would. We don't say yeah, like how much would, would a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could? There we saw it. Could. We don't say the letter L. It's just could. So could you lend? Do you know the meaning of the word lend? Prestar. Prestar. Okay, mm -hmm. yes. Lend. Lend yes. me a jacket. So this is more formal. If I say, could you lend me a jacket? Then we have this other one. Is it okay if I use your phone? Is it okay if I use your phone? So this is a little bit more formal. Do you mind if, and in this case, we're gonna use the if clause. If, do you know what is the meaning of if as well? Yeah. What is it? Yes. 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 What is the, it's like, uh -huh. it's a C sin tilde, verdad? Ajá, primero aprendemos a hablar español para hablar inglés. <laughs> yeah, if, if es yes. I mean, if es yes, pero como sin tilde. <laughs> See the condition, it's a condition. Is it okay if I use your phone? Si yo uso tu teléfono, is it okay? Do you mind if I use your CD burner? Oh my goodness, these examples are really old. CD burner. Do you remember that? I think I was like 12 years old, years old when that thing was going on. CD burner. <laughs> now we have a Spotify, right? We have a Deezer, we have yeah. YouTube. CD burner, yeah. 
Yeah, one day on Facebook, guys, I saw a post. They were selling a uh, USB with music. And I was like, who's going to buy the, a USB with music? <laughs> Who knows? Mm -hmm. And next mm -hmm. one. Would it be okay? So this is more, a little bit more form formal. Would it be okay if I picked? Now, if you realize this one here is in the past, like this one here is in the past, okay? Both are in the past parties, I mean the past simple. You can say it in the present, so it's okay if you say, would it be okay if I pick it up on Friday night? It's okay. But it's more formal if you use the past simple form in the verb, okay? So that gives it an extra formality, you wanna say, like something really formal. Would you mind if I borrowed your digital camera? If I borrowed your, your digital camera? Would you mind, and this is interesting, okay. Look at this example here and look at the other example here. In this case, we have if before the other sentence. So in that case, you're gonna use the verb like this, okay. But if we don't have if, and then we add a verb after the word mine, you need to use the verb in a gerund. So with the ing form. If I repeat, if you have if, it's okay to use it like this or in the present. But if you have mine and then you don't have anything but the verb, you're gonna use the verb in the gerund with ing. Do you get it? Okay. Perfect. Yes. Got it. Would you mind letting me use your laptop, please? You can add please to make it very polite. Okay. I wonder if I could borrow some money. Okay. I wonder if I could borrow some money. And the very, very formal way to say something is I was wondering. If you'd, remember, you'd, it's not you. If you'd, the D is there because there's a reason. I was wondering if you'd mind lending me, and you see mine, and then we have the verb. So we're going to use it with the gerund, yes? So I was wondering if you'd mind lending me your car, like lend here, the same lend. But in this case, we're going to use it with ing because we're saying mine. So I was wondering if you'd mind lending me your car. Okay, I'm gonna give you an example in this moment. Well, I'm gonna ask you to write an example. Think about this. You need a car to pick up your family from the airport. You are gonna ask someone to borrow you or to lend you a car. So if you can borrow or if someone can lend you a car. Let's think this person is your best friend. How are you gonna make the question or the request? Send it to the chat. What form are you gonna use if this person is your friend? You need a car to, you need a car, you need a car, okay? Send me an example to the chat. Remember to send it only to Inglés Corporativo, please. Because if you send it to everybody, yeah, yeah, they're gonna copy. Did you understand the activity or do you want me to repeat? Repeat. Okay, so you need a car for tomorrow because you need to go to the airport. And you are gonna ask for a car to your best friend. So how can we make the question? I'm gonna try with the second one. Mm -hmm. Could you could you mind if you send me if you let me your car for tomorrow for my family to go to the airport? Could you mind no, just could. No. Just could. Mm -hmm. 
could you lend me your car tomorrow mm -hmm. for mm -hmm. my, my family to go to April? Okay, from thank you. April to my house. Exactly, exactly. Thank yes. You. Thank you, Max. Yes. Thank you to you. Mm -hmm. Now, guys, the mm -hmm. other ones, you need to send it to the chat. And I'm going to be looking at the chat. Can I get your car? Well, <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's that's really like best friend. Could you, uh -huh, can I borrow your pickup? Well, guys, some people go to the airport <laughs> and they go in buses or big trucks with all the family. Even they, <laughs> even they take the chucho to take pick up someone from the airport. Oh my goodness, I have seen things like that. Don't say that. They're, they're pets. The too. <laughs> yeah, they. The I parakeet. Pay. Yeah, the parakeet. Whoa. Yeah, they take the parakeet. They take the dog. They 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 don't take the cat because the cats get mad in the cars. But if they can take the cat, they will take the cats. <laughs> Uh, okay, I see some people here talk very polite to your best friends. Okay, okay, that's good. I mean, um. now with that in mind, we're gonna do just one last exercise. That was the one that Marcos was asking. For example, the first one that says, you want to use your roommate's computer? Is it okay? If I use your computer. Now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> if, or, I if I use your computer. Okay, so let's do it. Excellent. It's like that. Yeah. Did you get it with the explanation? I know right. On I, know help right you? I know right. If. Oh, you didn't write if. Yeah. if. Oh, the conditional, the conditional. Okay. Yeah. You didn't write if. Okay. I'm looking at the examples. Can you lend me your car to go to the airport? I see one here that is very informal, <laughs> but that maybe is if it is your best friend. Can I get your car? This person is not saying tomorrow, no. <laughs> it's not saying to go to the airport, no. Just, hey, I need your car. Can I get your car? <laughs> yes or no? If you say no, you're not my best friend anymore. That's very polite, very polite. Okay, and remember, to use it just, and then we, we, we go. Remember to use the structure that is there. So that's never gonna change. Just lay, wait, 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 wait. Ya terminamos, don't worry. Here, remember that the ones that are in bold, bold significa negrita, the ones that are in bold, you need to keep it like that. So this structure is not gonna change. What is gonna change is the rest of the question, okay? So you're not gonna miss cool with mine, okay? Just like that. Keep this structure. Liliana, tell me. I have a question. Mm -hmm. uh, well, in the last sentences, mm -hmm. uh, what is if Use mine. I was wondering if you'd mind lending me your car. Si te importaría. Importaría. Me estaba preguntando si te importaría. Eso es lo mismo. Exactly. Okay. Así como se llega así todo apenado y dice, yo me preguntaba si te importaría prestarme <laughs> tu carro, like that. Okay. You'd sí. mind. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Okay, guys. Yeah, thank you for asking. Anytime you have questions, ask me. Okay, if there are not more questions, that's going to be the class for today, and I will see you tomorrow. Remember to keep on uh, working on the platform because that's very important, and by the end of 
this week. So by Thursday, we need to be done. We need to be done with section three and the meter. Okay. Okay. So you need. Para los que son nuevos hoy, you have work to do. Okay, teacher. Okay. Okay, teacher. Have a Thank great you. night, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye. Thank you. Bye. 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 Bye.